Hey, yo, what up? Uh, man, shit. Today's lesson, bro. You know, I just had some shit on the motherfucker brain, you know what I mean? Uh, black life, you know what I'm saying? I think we should just be, you know, you should start being stingy with your life, bro. You know? You shouldn't make yourself too accessible to people. You know what I mean? You got a lot of time on your hands. That's your time. What you choose to do with it, that's your choice. When you want other people's time, you playing their game. See, me, I only play games that I can win at. Once I'm in somebody else's arena, I know I'm getting jammed up. So make yourself as less accessible to people as possible. If motherfuckers want you, they'll pay you for your time. Ain't no friend shit. Ain't none of that shit, bro. Like, when you get older, you a man. So when you a man, you do man shit. You know? You put yourself in a position, man, where you want to fucking shoot somebody or do something to somebody, that's your fault. You playing in somebody else's arena. And then, you know, again, too, man, uh, the signs, bro. There are signs that if you can't stand in the room with a motherfucker no more than five minutes, that means y'all can't get along. So two motherfuckers that can't get along need to disperse. See, that's why I like my city, Chicago, man. I grew up in towns where it was like this. Respect is everything. You know what I'm talking about? You know, you either going to respect how you wear your hat, you're going to be, you going to respect how you talk to a motherfucker, and you're going to respect a nigga household. Period. Whether you learned that shit or not, if you come across an alpha male that demands respect for, for these things that I said, and that nigga want to try to feud you for it and shit. Listen, man. Get the fuck away from that motherfucker. You understand what I'm saying? Because uh, your values and principles, they still got to graduate to get there. So, like I said, man, you know what I mean? I keep my circle small like a motherfucking dot on a sheet of paper. And that's just the way it is for me, bro. So, I be tucked off, ducked off, all that shit. If a nigga want to fuck with me, man, you know how to reach me, man. You got my phone number, all that shit. Don't get on Facebook and all that shit. Talking about, goddamn it, man, I ain't hearing nothing from... Listen, if you really want to fuck with your mans in them, fuck with your mans in them. But going back to the topic, man, black life, bro. You know what I mean? I can only speak for me and my culture, you know, or just me, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? I, I mean, I'm at this point in my life, man. You know what I mean? The whole like we are the world and shit, holding hands across America, black shit. Yeah, we ain't never gonna get there, bro. Real talk. A lot of motherfuckers is in slave mentality still, bro. Niggas is still at looking, looking for the motherfucker piece of uh chitlin hanging off the table. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, that's what niggas doing. You know what I'm saying? You see a motherfucker. Man, you gonna talk behind niggas' backs, all this shit, man. That's an appetite for destruction, bro. You know? Don't be in places where, where niggas is at. You know? I fuck with black men. Like, kings. You know what I mean? Motherfuckers that know they value. Niggas that know. You know what I'm saying? When they walk in the room, nigga, you smell their cologne, nigga. So that's what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? That kind of shit. Man shit. All this old high school boy shit and all that shit. Listen, man. I'm 46 years old, man. I'm not finna be rolling around on the ground, man, with no nigga. You understand? Fuck that catch a fade shit and all that, nigga. Nigga, I study gun food, nigga. You know what I mean? So, nigga, you try to put your hands up, nigga. I might blow your, blow your motherfucker through your hands, nigga. That's how I get down. At the end of the day... My life is precious. How about you? Peace.